Hello and welcome back. So this is another Shop My Stash makeup basket video. I am very excited. This is going to be an update on the products and then I will pick out new products in the second half of the video. And if you are interested in this eye look, I did film a Shop My Stash Get Ready With Me using a palette that I had in my Shop My Stash a few months ago. And alrighty, so let's get into recapping the products. So I had picked out this highlighter. This is the Maybelline Master Chrome in Molten Gold. And it's a standard, very gold highlighter, but I did use it and it's gorgeous. I was actually considering maybe getting rid of this just because I feel like I have a lot of highlighters, but I'm glad I used this because I really, really loved it. So I am definitely keeping this. As far as a bronzer, I used this Beauty Benefits Hollywood Bronzer. This is from the Dollar Tree. I will link my dollar makeup review. This is so good. This is the color cinnamon and I'm wearing it as a contour today. This is really good. It blends out. It's a gorgeous color. Kind of has some olive in it, but it's not orange, but it's not too cool toned. So this works really well and I'm happy I got some use out of it. Then I had the Becca Chloe palette and again, I'm really happy with this. So no duds so far in this Shop My Stash. I'm wearing the blushes today combined and some of the highlighter combined with another highlighter. Like I said, I filmed this whole look, so I will link that for you. But yeah, this is something I got on major sale. I did not need it, so I'm glad I didn't pay full price, but the quality is really good. I mean, it's worth what it was full price, but yeah, it's awesome. And then for the eyeshadow palette, I picked the Dose of Colors Marvelous Mauves, which is definitely a neglected palette in my collection but I gotta say I really, really enjoyed it. So I did take pictures of two looks that I did that I will show you. The first look, I had this light pink in the on the lid actually, and then I had a light brown from the Natasha Denona Mini Nude Palette in the crease. Really simple look, super basic, but I did really enjoy it. And then the second look I am wearing combination of these three shades kind of mixed together all over the lid and in the crease this color i will say it's a pretty dark look you'll see in the picture it's way darker on the eyes than it looks in the pan here so it turned out way more smoky than i anticipated it to be but i gotta say this is a really nice palette these colors blend out so easily they're so smooth very pigmented more pigmented than i thought but yeah, I really am happy that I use this because I've kind of neglected it just because, I mean, it's monochromatic, which is the point of the palette. So I just felt a little bit limited by it, but I'm very happy I used it. Alrighty, so that was my recap. I'm pretty happy with the items I picked. I got pretty good use out of them. So let me show you picking out some new items. I do want to start by picking out a lip gloss. I don't think I had a lip product last time, so... ABH, uh, I don't know. Actually, I wanna go with a NYX Butter Gloss. So this one here in Apple Strudel, I really, really like this. It's super pretty peachy color, so I want to go with this. Let's see, as far as blush and bronzer, I do think I want to pick maybe one of each. Um, you know, I don't think I've used this that much. And this is probably my favorite bronzer ever. This is the Marc Jacobs in Tantastic. So I think I wanna go with this. As far as blush, let's see what I have not used in a while. This was in a re recent Shop My Stash. I think I wanna go with the ABH Blush Trio. This one is, I got this at Marshall's. What's this one called? Cocktail Party. I really, really like it, so I need to get more use out of this. I do wanna pick out a highlighter. Um, I know you can't see in this drawer very well, but that's okay. You know, I think I'm gonna go with this Urban Decay in Sin. This is so fantastic. I talked about this, I think, in an underhyped makeup video. This is gorgeous. It's kind of on the subtle side, so I'm going with this. Alrighty, I wanna pick out one eyeshadow palette. Um, kind of debating on the Tartlet in Bloom. This was my Pan That palette last year, and I used it last week, and I really loved it. So that's an option. Um, or 
I'm kind of debating picking an ABH palette again. Let's see here. So Sultry is an option. I actually did use this color last week. Love it. Soft Glam. Probably my favorite palette ever. Would love to get more use out of that. And I love Norvina. Also, hmm. You know, I think I want to go with Soft Glam. I've officially declared this my favorite palette ever. So I need to get more use on it. Alrighty, so that is it for this Shop My Stash. I picked out five products. I am very excited. I will link my Shop My Stash playlist, and thank you for watching.